hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here I just want to say welcome and please subscribe if you haven't already and don't forget to hit that notification bell next to it so that way you don't miss any of my videos so today I'm going to be doing a reverse canvas of photos of my children and it's going to look like this so if this is something you guys want to do um, keep on watching so here are the materials that we're going to need a blank canvas and I got this from Michaels and of course I use my coupon for that um, a rotary blade a foam brush and I'm going to use this it's a this is the stain midwax and it's espresso I'm going to use a printable HTV don't forget about that one all right oh and a glue gun with glue stick and I think that should be it and I'm going to link everything below in the description box. Okay. So I already have the photo on my screen and I'm just going to the upper left corner of my screen and click on file, scroll down to print, then click on fill entire paper, click on preview drop down, and choose print settings. On print quality, choose best, and just confirm that your printer is going to print in color. Then click print. So I have the back of the canvas facing me and I'm going to use my rotary blade to cut all four sides of the canvas in front of the staples. You can also use a sacto knife or a box cutter. Just try to cut slowly and make sure that you cut away from yourself. These blades are extremely sharp. The reason I'm cutting the way I'm doing it is because I struggle with the light I'm using and this seems to be easier for me to see what I'm doing. And once you're done, make sure to put the blade protector back on and put it aside. Now I'm ready to stain the frame. And I'm using a piece of cloth to remove excess stain. And continue to stain the rest of the frame. And use the cloth to remove excess again. Now that I'm done staining, I'm going to take this outside to dry for a couple of hours. While waiting for the frame to dry, I'm just going to prepare the photo and canvas. This printable is for light color, so I'm going to place the print out facing down. Center it, and I'm taking this to my heat press. Per instruction of my printable vinyl, I have my heat press at 380 and going to press between 20 to 25 seconds. I'm just going to let this cool down, then gently remove the backing of the iron on. The frame is already dry and just going to place this on top of the image, find the center, Then apply a little bit of the glue, flip it. I prefer to apply the hot glue little by little on each side as I'm pulling the canvas tight and straight. So I'm going to fold the excess of the canvas this way I can see the crease. Take my ruler. Then trim the excess canvas with my rotary blade. Then repeat on all sides. Then I found these doodads which I will also link under the description box. Just find the center and put these tiny screws on both sides. And there you go. 
All right, you guys, let me know what you think of this video. If you find this helpful, please give it a big thumbs up or leave me a comment of what you think of it. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you guys later.